It could be seen for kilometres and was noticed by thousands of people in and around South Sydney. A giant smokestack churning and burning smoke and flame at two o'clock in the afternoon. It was centred in the Quinos plastics plant at Botany. The fire brigade was flooded with triple O calls. Social media went into meltdown. Shots of a flare from all angles and people clearly in the dark about what was going on. So we did the windows up straight away because you could smell it straight away as well. But I've um, never seen that before around here, so yeah, it was a bit concerning. What happened was that the plant had lost power. As a result, gases inside the factory were funnelled into the flare and burnt off. In a statement, the company said the Quenos flare system was operated as part of the safe shutdown of the Quenos botany plant. The loss of power also meant the plant lost steam. According to the company, that meant more smoke. It goes off every now and then, but years ago it used to go off all the time. And in the middle of all this, the flame off started a small grass fire near the base of the flare and had to be put out. While the fire brigade wasn't concerned about today's dramas, the Environment Protection Authority has launched an investigation. It noted a similar flare event in 2012 resulted in Quenos being fined, even though there was no risk to the surrounding community. Mark Burrows, Nine News. Reporter Vicky Jardins at Banks Meadow for us tonight. Vicky, this has really caused quite a lot of concern in the community. It certainly has, Pete. This plant behind me has been closed indefinitely, but residents here are demanding answers. They're, of course, quite alarmed when they saw 